Welcome to the guided method video. In this video we will learn what a guided method is and how to run a guided method. Guided methods are interactive and intelligent diagnostic procedures designed to help technicians diagnose difficult, common, or reoccurring comeback issues. Guided methods are developed on an ECU and DTC basis, so guided method coverage will be limited initially. Additional guided methods will be developed making them more common as time goes on. Guided methods can be found on the DTC tab. For DTCs that have a guided method, the guided method is displayed in the DTC list under the DTC it applies. Let's run a guided method. Note: Improvements or alterations to this guided method may have occurred since the recording of this video. We'll run the guided method on P0299-00, turbocharger under boost. First, Select the guided method to launch it. The guided method diagnostic launches within YTEC. Read the guided method message and select continue. The turbocharger underboost guided method asks if a vehicle scan and freeze frame report have been saved. If not previously saved, select the no radio button and then continue, which will exit the guided method allowing you to manually save these reports in YTEC. If previously saved, Select the Yes radio button and then Continue. The turbocharger guided method notifies the user that the DTCs will be cleared and they'll be required to cycle the ignition off and on five times. Select the Continue button when ready to proceed. The turbocharger underboost guided method clears DTCs and progresses to the ignition prompts. Complete the ignition prompt requests. This guided method asks the user to reference the vehicle scan and freeze frame report to allow them to operate the vehicle under the conditions when the DTC previously set. After completing this request, select Continue. The turbocharger underboost guided method reads the DTCs and sees that P0299-00 turbocharger underboost has returned and lists other present PCM DTCs if any of the other PCM DTCs are related to the P0299-00 fault. Select Continue. This guided method momentarily displays a message to turn the ignition off, then instructs the user to check for specific mechanical faults. In this instance, no mechanical faults were found, so we select the No radio button and then Continue. The guided method instructs the user to check for additional specific mechanical faults. These mechanical faults were not present on this vehicle, so we select the No radio button and then continue. The turbocharger underboost guided method momentarily displays a message to turn the ignition off, then instructs the user to check for other specific mechanical faults. In this instance, no mechanical faults were found, so we select the No radio button and then continue. The guided method requests the user to perform the intake air system leak detection procedure. Start the procedure and select continue. The turbocharger underboost guided method gives additional details on performing the intake air system leak detection procedure and asks if any leaks were detected. No leaks were detected, so we select the no radio button, then continue. This guided method has the user check for specific electrical faults. No electrical faults were found, so we select the No radio button and then Continue. The guided method then asks the user if they have a load test tool available. If the user selects No, they'll be provided instructions on how to build one. We have a load test tool available, so we'll select the Yes radio button and then Continue. The turbocharger underboost guided method instructs the user to disconnect the boost pressure actuator harness connector and then select Continue. The guided method instructs the user to load test the ASD circuit at the harness connector. Select Continue when the test is complete. This guided method asks if the load test bulb illuminated bright. It did, so we select the Yes radio button, then Continue. The guided method has the user test the ground circuit. Select Continue when the ground test is complete. This guided method asks if the load test bulb illuminated bright. It did, so we select the Yes radio button, then Continue. The guided method requests the user check resistance of a specific circuit and then enter the measured value. The ohmmeter read 0.003 ohms, 
so we enter that value and select continue. The turbocharger underboost guided method instructs the user to replace the turbocharger assembly in accordance with the service information. Select close to complete the turbocharger underboost guided method. YTEC may request feedback on the guided method. If feedback is requested, please provide valid feedback and select continue. We complete the turbocharger replacement and verify the fix. The P0299-00 turbocharger underboost condition is repaired. Thanks for watching. For additional information and support, consult service information, the YTech knowledge base, or contact YTech support. Please select the YTech button to subscribe to our YouTube channel and enable notifications from the FCA YTech channel to keep up to date on all the latest YTech news and how-tos.